Straight to another story. Let's talk about uh, the Labour Party, where the leadership crisis rocking the Labour Party is far from over. In the latest twist to the crisis, the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, has refused to recognize Julia Sabure as the party's national chairman. In a counter affidavit filed in response to Labour Party's suit challenging its exclusion from the Commission's refresher training for uploading party agents, INEC insisted that Abure's tenure as the national chairman of the Labour Party expired in June 2024. So it's going, going, and going <laughs> for Abure. INEC declaring Julius Abure's tenure as the Labour Party chairman has expired. Is this the beginning of the end for Julius Abure? Interesting. Um, I think... INEC has not done anything wrong with your position, but I would rather look at Labour Party as what is the plan B outside this issue as we speak. We're having three factions in Labour Party. Yes, the fact that it's tenure ended, why don't we have or why don't we have a convention, you know? to bring in a new NWC. Why do we have to wait to, for the governor of Abia State, which according to the Abu'is faction, does not have the local standard yeah, to, call to for, even call for that meeting mm. and call it NEC? Okay. So there are many layers to this crisis that the Liberal Party is not confronting head on. So for me, INEC has only said that we don't know about the convention you held to okay. bring in yourself again. So INEC has not erred in, in my view. But who do INEC relate with? The NEC that conveyed that meeting, as INEC recognized them, where we have uh, Usman, mm. you know, as the caretaker mm. chairperson, where does the law back that decision? Okay. Trust me, the case... Somewhere, somewhere, my being caught, you know. You, before you know, you just see that. You see judgment. They, they, ca they, called, it, they called it stakeholders meeting, not neck meeting. Exactly. And it takes the neck to take that decision. Mm. Because for the neck to say, oh, the NWC has finished its term. Let us convey a meeting. Let's announce a new date for the convention. That, has, like, that is yet to take place. Mm. Which I think the caretaker committee that was set up will be thinking of now. Okay. But is it recognized by INEC? Okay, so do you understand? So, so, so there, INEC has not recognized that of Abure. We don't know if they are going to recognize the. You, and the, there's another one, which I, 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 in fact, that makes it a more complex, complex situation, situation where we have three factional chairperson, mm. you know, claiming. But then Abure is saying, if you say you have a caretaker committee, who are the people working with you at different state level? Because most of the, if not all the states, recognize Abure as their national chairman. Is Labour Party not supposed to have subnationals? Okay. Are they not supposed to be a national party? Mm. Is it about you know the 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 the, the what happens with the discretion okay. of a governor? Because that man was elected as a governor, mm. not as the leader of the party. Because technically speaking, it should be the chairman of the party that should be calling the shot. Where is the board of trustees in all these things? Mm. I'm not sure whether the Labour Party has a template for okay. BOT. But in all these things, I just feel that Labour Party needs to have a real family meeting and really decide on the way forward. Bring in INEC, hold the convention, and now have a new chairman. Well, Otherwise, I'm still going yes, to, I'm okay. still going to come to you on the next line of action for Julius Abreu. But let me. Um, bring it to uh, Tony Abatan here. Let's get some clarity because the convention that was held in March that re-elected Julius Abure, uh, INEC has come out to declare that it's null and void. Tell us exactly, what, what was wrong with that convention that makes Julius Abure's uh, re-election null and void? What was wrong with it? If you could recall, uh, let me begin by saying that the Labour Party has a this is 2024. As of mm. 2021, he never prepared for the public acclaim. He got later, early last year, before the election. A lot of people rushed into the Labour Party when, for many other parties. 
And when you have a lot of entrance into a party that is seen as a party likely to win election, mm. you are bringing more tendencies inside that party. Okay. After the party is unable to win as many seats as mm. they are anticipate, everybody will find their level. And some people will fight for the soul of the party. Okay. As, as it is now, because the Liberal Party has only one state, clearly, that you can see is a government. Mm. And in most of the parties, APC and, 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 and South mm. APC and PDP, when you have a really a sitting governor, okay. the most senior among them is assumed to be the leader of the party. Okay. Uh, as, as, but the problem the Liberal Party has is that there are a lot of interest in the party that did not allow that March election to be genuine because people are disgruntled about the way the national leadership of the party has been run. The, the party has been formed around one particular individual. Okay. And that one, that, that one individual is no more capable of being firm. You can okay. remember what happens to Julius Apata and all of that. He fought Aburi. All of them were fighting different angles immediately mm -hmm. after the election. So when they were fighting, like you said, you are, you are creating more tendencies as you are creating more factions. Okay. When you are creating more factions, you are creating more power centers. There are a lot of many power centers within the Liberal Party mm -hmm. because of the potentials of the party doing many other things. Mm -hmm. But if that problem is not resolved now, if the party failed or refused to call a family meeting, a family meeting to, to sink their differences and come together mm. as a party that have seen move. I doubt it. it will be because difficult they came to, from different mm. parties to form their party to win election. It is not about the policy or manifesto of the party. You can remember the manifesto of the party did not come out but probably two weeks or four weeks before the election. So this means people came from different areas to come to that family to take positions. Mm. Unfortunately, when mo most of them cannot take positions, they begin to grumble. Okay. And they, now, they are now asking for, come and audit the account of the party. No, as at, as at last month, people are still saying that they should, must audit the national, uh, the, the account of the party okay. as of 2023 before the election because some people donated money. So these are things that are causing conflict. But the party is ready to come together, like mm. you said, as a family party okay. and sing their differences and have one focus. There, are many, there will be continued many tendencies okay. and many schemes within the party that will make reconciliation very, very difficult. difficult. And the ruling governor, now, the onus now is on him is to either swim with the party. Swim because he has, to, he has to make sure that he wins the a real election. How does he do that? By holding his party in the state, okay. firm in his hand, um. not allowing it to be subjected to the whims and caprices of other people. tendencies. <laughs> and winning mostly, because that's very, very important. By the time you is not one state, what will happen they are also going to the elections. So they are going to election. Mm. So well, it is about right. whether they are still very strong. Okay. Okay. Next line of action for Julius Abure. Head to court or political search? Unfortunately or coincidentally, he has actually dealt with that. The issue is not in his hand to this extent that what brought him in mm -hmm. was just a matter of I'm going to go my own way, yes. whether legally or illegally. Mm -hmm. So how do you hold a convention without inviting delegates Across, across the, the board. Okay. You are fighting with the NLC at that time, or mm -hmm. the NLC president, who also felt I am, you are a personnel non grata. Like <laughs> yeah. So he's doing his own. Now we now have the governor. And like I said, I'm sorry to use that word again. I'm sure some of his followers may not like this. This is where the presidential candidate, who was the rallying point, point. should have come in. Call all of them. Bring them into one room. This is not time to take sides. At this time, do you Bring think Itobi has that capital it, it, to... The problem with Abu now is that he does not see him as his leader. He views he has already taken side with it's the other party. party. As a father, as a number one person, you need sides. to bring everybody. Mm. Irrespective of it. At least Abu was still the chairman during your... Your, 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 your quest to become president. president. Mm. Even if he did anything wrong, bring them together. I know politics is deeper than that. There are people, you will start suspecting them, you want to go with the labor. Mm. Irrespective of those interests, you're supposed to act together. Mm. This has happened to other parties. But there must be a rallying point. There must be someone who must bring them together. Because the labor party we are talking about today mm. was because of Peter Obi. Yes. So mm. he needs to act on his name. He needs to act with, with the stature that he has gained mm. to bring them together. Otherwise, trust me, he can go to court, he can do all those things. It's just going to create more trouble okay. for Labour Party. Next line of action for Julius. Well, the next line of action is... You think Peter Obi can, has that capital to call for... He should demonstrate enough uh, 
capacity. Enough capacity. To be able to rule his house. Because that would be the test of his, of his being capable of ruling Nigeria. You think they've made country. a decision by ostracizing? Of course. Uh, well, 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 yes, yes. I, you I think, think they've made a decision. No, 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 no. I, I, I think you should, you should go about that, like you say, call the family meeting, let pe people forget their individual let interests. Bygones, we bygones. Let bygones be bygones. Mm. Those people are clamoring for auditing of the party. Make sure it is well audited because it is very, very important. That is the issue of money. Your money comes is... So, mm -hmm. and Peter B, like he said, Peter B was actually, I didn't mention that time, it was the symbol. So, by the time he came in to the Labour Party nine and a half years ago, the party lost momentum. He became the father figure. Mm. And by the time he lost the election, the party, and everybody started pursuing Sanjee their own Shepard. individual okay. That and is the Shepard. problem. Okay. So he has to rise above board, mm. bring everybody together, yes. and be a father figure. Mm. And for now, you should forget about politics, internal politics, the party. The internal politics of the Labour Party. Because that is the own doing. Mm. All right. Thank you so much, Cindy uh, Abaton. Thank you so much for having this conversation with me. Kai Deladengi. Thank you very Always much. Always a pleasure. For having this conversation with 